Good morning, folks. We've got earthquakes continuing to surge back to life and rising in magnitude. We're going to take a look at progress on understanding the unsung hero of cosmology, but let's begin with our star over at spaceweathernews.com. It's another day without sunspots or solar flares, no plasma filaments or other eruptions, just the intensified solar wind from the darker coronal holes. We can see a resurgence in solar wind speed to over 500 kilometers per second in purple there in the telemetry. Still can't manage to calm down, but it's relatively weak nature. It's not at 800 or 700 kilometers per second, still under 6 leaves the disruption to Earth's shield being relatively minor thus far. It is a four-day intensification in which the Earth is gliding now, due to the massive now-departed coronal holes. But the northern opening behind it, already facing Earth there, connecting magnetically, will drive solar wind intensifications midweek and will now come to the lithosphere where two more six-pointers make the list. After more than two weeks without a magnitude 6 earthquake, this makes three and four in the last 48 hours. Mini surge. So folks, cosmic dust. Seems like one of the least important aspects of the universe, right? It may be the key to answering dark matter, as well as some of the other observations that conflict with their accepted paradigms. This paper discusses dust seriously in the scattering and light extinction realm, including notes on how previous studies were not good at detecting large grains, and how they were able to make their models work while increasing the potency of that dust as an actor on our perspective. This is indeed where our cosmology hypothesis finds a chair. Website members, in your deeper look section, we've been on a dark matter tear the last few weeks, in addition to having eight recent episodes aimed at helping you fully grasp a lot of those topics in cosmology, we are indeed past the number of deeper looks due out by the end of next month, so this has been a bit of a doting start to 2018 for the members in that section. We greatly appreciate your support. We've got your wind maps and shots of our star to close. We'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now. It's 5.20 a.m. in the new valley of the sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone.